Hi everyone, it's Ardeth, and today I'm here with a quick galaxy sky that I made using Catherine Pooler inks and some new products that were released on June 20th. I recently took a class with Heather Telford where we made galaxy skies using color burst powders, distress oxide inks, and watercolors. I decided to give my Catherine Pooler inks a go, and they didn't disappoint. I started with about a million of them. The idea is to layer up the colors so that you see them glowing through the darkness. I'm using Bristol Smooth cardstock, and I start with the lighter colors and I work my way through to the darker ones. The process is to smoosh your ink onto the work surface, spritz it with some water, and then pick it up with your panel and dry it. It's very repetitive and pretty scary along the way, so I sped up the video until we get to the good part. I learned two very important things from the class, and we're seeing them both here. Lesson one, you have very little control. You want to keep an area in the center a bit lighter, so you'll see as my inks get darker, I focus on the edges of my cardstock. And lesson two, it gets ugly before it gets beautiful, so just keep working. Once I hit the Juniper Mist, Blackjack, and finally Midnight, you can see the sky taking on an extraterrestrial glow, and you can see bits of all the colors through the darkness. I discovered while doing this that Midnight Ink can be tricky to get off your craft mat, so be sure to wash it off right away. I let mine sit for a little while and I had to work hard to remove it. When I was finished with my ink smooshing, I spritzed some water over the panel to create some lighter spots over the whole sky. Once my panel was dry, I splattered some white acrylic paint over it as stars, and then I used dyes from Starlight to create negative space in my panel. Today is the second day of blog hops celebrating this month's release, and there are prizes if you hop along and comment, so be sure to click on the link below to go to my blog. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day.